This week from Mom's Cookbook Collection, we're going to be modifying a recipe from the January 2003 edition of Betty Crocker Simple Winter Meals. These are little cookbooks uh, published by Betty Crocker, my mom collected for a little while. And we're going to be modifying a barbecue beef and corn shepherd's pie, but instead of the half a package of Betty Crocker cheddar and bacon mashed potatoes, we're going to be using fresh mashed potatoes and we're going to be adding some bacon. We're going to be also adding some ingredients. One pound of ground beef, one half cup of onion, chopped, one cup of barbecue sauce, one 15 ounce can of whole kernel corn, one four ounce can of diced green chilies undrained. The original recipe called for a one half package, seven ounce of Bitty Crocker cheddar and bacon mashed potatoes. I'm going to be using five medium sized uh, potatoes boiled and mashed, one third cup of milk, two tablespoons of butter, three quarters cups of shredded Fiesta blend cheese, and to this I will be adding one 15 ounce can of peas drained, one orange pepper chopped, and six slices of pre-cooked bacon chopped, and a 10 inch skillet brown the meat with the bacon and the onion. Add the rest of the ingredients and bring to a boil. Peel and boil the potatoes for 15 minutes. In a food processor, mix the butter and the milk with the potatoes. Now, I don't know what it is about this recipe, but every time I try to do it, I have problems with one of my cameras. In a deep casserole dish, Add first the meat and the vegetables, then a layer of potatoes, then the rest of the meat and vegetables topped off with potatoes and cheese. Bake at 350 degrees for 40 minutes. Let's see what we got. Mm. Excellent. This is from one of those little recipe cookbooks, uh, Winter Meals from Betty Crocker. It was originally designed to be used with a uh, Betty Crocker instant uh, potatoes, but I made the potatoes, I made the mashed potatoes from um, from scratch. But um, uh, the actual cookbook is in my car. It's blowing a blizzard right now. I'm not going to go get it. But I'm going to say is that this recipe was a winner. Mm -hmm.